we haven't seen anything like this since really since the Great Depression here in our state. Many students have been out of work ever since the pandemic hit. With tuition and rent still due, some have been struggling to find a job. Kenzie is a senior and had a job at the International House in the spring. Several months later, it's still closed. Most of us left to go home not knowing that like it wasn't going to open up again. You can't really breathe easy until you know that you have something lined up. Emmanuel is also a senior and had two jobs in the restaurant business. His work also to a halt. Financially, it has been hard. I was left without a job and I haven't been able to work like I did before or since. According to a campus survey from the Career Center, 32% of students have lost internships completely, while others have been able to get work online. There's opportunities that can be done virtually. But what about the job market in general? Michael Burnick is the former director of the California Employment Development Department with some state insight. There's been no significant uptick in hiring. and we, We've seen businesses closing permanently. And that's very much of concern to us in, in the California economy. However, some business owners have been able to hire students during this time. My whole team is fairly new. I would say I'm trying to give the students that are living here that need to pay their rent, give them an opportunity to be able to do that. Graduating seniors entering the workforce soon are unsure of what's to come next. I'm definitely worried about, you know, my future prospects of finding a job after I graduate. For the meantime, take anything. If a student puts time and energy into finding an opportunity, they will have a job after school. Manuel and Kenzie have both found internships off campus recently, but many other students are still on the search. I'm Amanda Ramirez, Cal TV News.